Hey guys, I'm Kelsey Colleen and you're watching BuzzNet. Good for you. I became interested in blogging about eight years ago. Um, it was sort of when blogging first started and everyone had a blog spot and there wasn't really an honest voice about what it was like to be sort of a 20-something girl. It was a lot of like Cosmo and Glamour magazines that you're like supposed to be hot and perfect and use this cream and then you would, you know, and I wanted to just be sort of that honest voice that was like, I'm in New York, I'm in show business, it kind of sucks. Sometimes I feel really sad and just want to like crawl into a hole and I'm going to be honest about it and people really took a liking to it. You know, I was dancing as a professional dancer in a Radio City Rockette in New York for six years, which was amazing. And then, you know, this past year I worked with Beyonce and I decided to retire and just write full time. I'm not sure that I ever dreamed of being a writer or an inspiration to people, but I always knew that I was going to be a leader in some way. And I think that um, maybe I thought I was going to lead in a different way, but I'm leading online, you know, and it's so amazing to see people posting reposting things that I've written and like getting tattoos of like sayings I've said and stuff and and sort of like subscribing to me as like this idol girl you know in their hearts which is mind-blowing NBC had an award show called the Giving Awards and it was five big charities in America that all had to get their Facebook fans and vote and the charity that I work super closely with to write love in our arms won the one million dollar prize and I was up on stage with um, Jamie when he won and the confetti was coming down and I felt like it was my Oscar moment and it, it tied so closely to um, what I do on my blog I would say my style is like boho, rocker, sweet, chic. Like I like to be sweet and girly, but I also like to sometimes be a little bit rock and roll. And then I also kind of like girly things, but not hot pink. I hate hot pink, but I like anything but hot pink. I think that the one thing that makes me the happiest is when someone who is sitting at home unsure about their own future gets out of bed and follows their dreams because of something I wrote. Giving the gift of someone having a better life is the best thing, and it's so amazing how powerful our words are. 